get ready for Mikey Sun TV. Four, three, two, one, zero. Hey, what's going on guys? How's everyone doing today? I'm doing well, thank you for asking. Well, as you can see, we are in Mikey Sun's gym. That's right. We're gonna do a little bit of workout on my new Titan Fitness Lat Pull Down Rowing Machine, guys. Just a little bit of a workout. Give us something to look forward to in upcoming videos whenever I get more equipment. So, what are we going to do? Today we're going to do some lat pull downs, some tricep press downs, and some seated rows. And right now I'm only going to leave the 35s on. Let's take a look. Got 35s on each side. And to be honest, that's all we need. <clears throat> that's all we need, guys. <laughs> Let me fix that about right there. And... I'm going to start. Oh. Now eventually, eventually I'll get my camera set up to where we can do a little bit better angles and stuff. But uh, first and foremost, I have to take it real easy because of this shoulder and the pain that goes into my bicep. So we just take it easy. All right. Keep good form. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. There we go. All right, good stuff, right? Works like a charm. Good quality. Good quality machine, I'm happy with it so far. All right, let's do some rows. All right, we're gonna do some seated rows, guys. Now, it's best if you can bolt this thing down. It has spots on both the front and back to bolt it down, but being in a house, uh. I don't want to do that because I have flooring, of course, but it is an option. Now I'm going to use the short bar for these seated rows just because it's hooked up. And I still got the 35s on it. We're going to take it nice and slow and get a good squeeze in the back. All right. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. And I'm keeping my reps in the 12 rep range. It's going to be anywhere from about 10 to 15 reps. Because uh, I like the way that feels. Both muscle-wise and mental-wise. <laughs> so, all right, let's do some tricep press downs. And again, unfortunately, I only have the 35s as light as I have. So it's a little heavy for me on this movement right now, but uh, we'll make the best of it. I'm, I'm gonna get some 25s within the next week. So we just wanna keep good form Make sure your body's nice and got good solid foundation. You don't want to be all over the place. And I got to take it real easy. Here we go. And you get a squeeze in. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 10. All right, I'm gonna stick with 10 reps on those because that's really heavy for me. 
right now, but I believe I have pretty good form. Now, eventually, when you get used to working out and you're throwing some heavy weights on there, using your body English to, to push through some reps is totally normal. As long as you're not compromising your back or, or you know, maybe, uh, you know, potential injuries elsewhere, uh, putting some put some good uh, body English in there whenever you're doing stuff is okay. Uh, but as of right now, I'm taking it super easy. Um, so we're going to go to another set of uh, lat pull downs. Okay. All right. Here we go, guys. Nice, easy, controlled movements. We don't want to get hurt. All right. We're not 20 years old anymore, right? Here we go. I'm getting a nice stretch. I can feel it stretching over here real good. All right, here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. 12. There we go. Ah, now make sure, don't forget, my camera's a little crooked. Let me straighten that up a smidgen. Hi, how's everyone doing? All right, don't forget, when you come down with these, you don't just want to do the movements. You want to make sure you're squeezing whenever you come down. Get a nice squeeze in that back and them shoulder blades. Make sure you're bringing them puppies together. Boom, not these puppies, your back puppies. Now, get a nice little squeeze in there and when you release, let all these fibers and everything stretch out and open up. You're gonna open up the muscle fibers and let that blood rush in. All right, that's what working out does. It breaks down your muscles and then the rest period and all that, the healing, it builds them up. So yeah, you just gotta kinda watch what you're doing and pay attention. All right, let's go to another set of tricep press downs. Now this time, this time I might only do maybe eight reps because I can feel that those are pretty heavy. And uh, this is really my first uh, go around of the workout. I've, I've been in here messed around with it a bit, but this is the first kind of cycle that I've done on it. So I'm probably gonna knock the reps down to eight until I get some lighter weights. All right, all right, going for the tricep press down. Again, I'm only going to do about eight reps until I get some lighter weight. So I got my hands about an inch or so from the, from the center here where it hooks on. Sometimes I go in all the way to the triangle area to where it hooks. Sometimes I'll come out just a bit. It just depends. Uh, so let's, uh, let's make sure we got a good posture here. Don't rush yourself. And get a nice little overhand grip and control. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. All right, good job. All right, now we're going to go for our. Uh, our seated rows, guys. So let's do those. I think this time I'm gonna take my longer lap bar and put it on the bottom so I do a little bit wider grip. All right, once again, let's make sure that we are nice and firm where we wanna be. We don't wanna to have to adjust while we're working out. Let's get our feet where we need them. Make sure that our, our back and everything is relaxed a little bit. I'm gonna grab this nice wide grip and we're gonna pull it in to about bottom of the chest and get a good squeeze in that back and then a nice stretch at the end. All right, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, Eight, nine, ten, eleven, 
12. Whew. I even felt that in my traps a little bit. You should mostly feel that in your arms and, and in, your, in your back and lats. But I was feeling it a little bit in my traps there. That's all right. That happens. All right, let's do another set of the lat pull downs. All right. Here we go. Now, this will probably be my last go through. I don't want to overdo it and be extremely sore. So uh, going through it three times is going to be all I'll do today, probably. So we'll start right here. Nice little stretch. All right. I'm going to bring it down and squeeze them shoulder blades. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. 11, 12, there we go. All right, guys. Now we're gonna do our tricep press down. So let's do that. All right. So I got the camera away just a bit so you can see just a little better, maybe how I'm standing and all that. So again, I'm probably only gonna do eight reps. And I'm gonna go in all the way to the as far as I can go right here. Okay. Got a nice stance. All right. Here we go, guys. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. There we go. Yeah. One more set of seated rows and we're done with this little session today. So let's get down there and do those. All right, guys, here we are. Let's get these seated rows done. I went ahead and just attached the small bar back because the longer one is up top. So we're just gonna use this short one again. Again, make sure you're nice and planted where you want to be. Slight bend in your legs. And we're going to keep it nice and steady and slow. Again, squeezing the shoulder blades together as best we can and putting all the effort in to our back. All right, guys. Here we go. We're going to get 10 to 12. Here we go. One. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. We're going to do one more for the heck of it. 13. Let it out slow, baby. All right. And we're done. All right. All right. Well, guys, there you have it. My first real, what I would consider my first real official workout on my new Titan Fitness high and low pulley lap machine. Now, what do I think about it? I think it's pretty awesome. I really like it and I see me getting a lot of use out of it. And I've had the cheaper versions of some lap machines uh, before and I used the heck out of them uh, to the point that they were breaking pulleys. So I love using these type of machines uh, for all the versatility that they give. Uh, the nice control and the fluid range of motion, even with your low budget friendly uh, models, they're still, uh, they're still good and capable to give you a good workout. Okay, I just chose to go up a little notch on this and, and get this. So, uh, would I recommend it? Yeah, I would. Yep, 100% guys. So, I hope you enjoyed this quick little uh, workout. I hope to start sharing and uploading more workouts 
as I do them and as I get more uh, fitness equipment. Still waiting on my dumbbells. It could still be three weeks to eight weeks. It just depends. Unfortunately, the company is behind schedule, so it's going to be a little while before I get them. However, until that time, I'm going to keep using this. And uh, either this weekend or next weekend, it just depends. I'm going to go and grab a couple of 25 pound plates so that way I can uh, maybe utilize the, the you know, tricep push down just a little bit more. And not only that, I can get in some bicep, a little bit of a bicep cable curl. Uh, the only bad thing about that is whenever you're pulling this way on the bottom, uh, it wants to tilt the machine. So that's a reason that it's good to bolt them down if you can. Uh, you can also set a weight on the bench, you know, the part where, you, where your butt goes. You can set a weight there, but if you can, it's nice to bolt them down, which you never know. That might have to be an option at some point. It just depends. So thanks for joining along. I'm going to clean this room out eventually and get it pretty much just for uh, my gym, my home gym that I hope to get many years of use from. Also, using my new GoPro Hero 9. All right. Awesome, huh? All right, guys. Hope you enjoyed the channel. Like, share, subscribe, comment. All that good stuff. Check out the playlist. Check all the videos. All the good stuff. I have all sorts of goodies in there for you to enjoy. Probably for the next three years. All right? Also, check out my other channel, Old Mental Pickle. That's where I live stream video games. Unless I'm having trouble live streaming. There's one game that I'm having trouble live streaming. It's Trine 4. T-R-I-N-E 4. Really cool puzzle game, but good lord. For some reason it gives me a, a time when I'm trying to stream it. Anyway, like, share, subscribe, comment on there. Uh, I'm pretty much family friendly channels. I try to keep it all nice and polite and decent and uh, no cussing or, or anything like that. So... Anyway, guys, I'm out of here. I got stuff to do. I got a movie discussion to go finish up, okay? Get up, get out, get rad, do it to it. And we'll leave you with one of these, man. Oh. Ow. Get up, get out, get around and do it, do it!